Zuzi Bird and welcome back to Yoku's Island Express. And today, we have made our way to Sal, who needs our help finding some guys. We talked about it last episode. The Crystal Deep is dark and dangerous. You should be careful in there. Yes, we should. Hello, can I talk to you? Come on then, I'll show you the secret entrance. Keep up. Okay, so let's follow him around. So we now know the secrets of some of the stuff that's been popping up recently. Uh, like when we do all the Wickerling stuff. There is a hidden path above here. Oh, the path leads to the Crystal Deep. Tread lightly out there. The Crystal Deep, huh? Let's go for it, whoa, okay. Here we are. Heading towards the Crystal Deep. And we found a lot of cool stuff in the last episode. We learned how to swim, which was the most important thing. And what about this? This looks like we can purchase this. What'll this do for us? Launches up this way. Oh, a bit of a shortcut, cool. So I'll go ahead and grab that. That is how many Wickerlings? We have five right now. So if we can get five more, we can unlock another Wickerling thing for the egg that was to our right at the beginning of the episode. Cool stuff. Oh gosh, I'm being launched. Uh, I'm being launched all over the place, but I don't know what I'm really doing. This is the Crystal Deep now. Oh hey, the Screech. Got, got the others. I think I managed to get away. Oh no, are you okay, buddy? Uh, he's stuck. Whoa, whoa. That's a little scary. How am I gonna break him open? I don't know. There's like no like force and momentum around there. I'm a little confused and scared and worried. What in the world is this thing under me? It's like a rock with a face on it. I don't like it. Oh. I need some things to, oh, hey. Oh, you're a ghost. The great gate kept the screech locked away in ancient times. If you seek the lair of evil, then the seal must be broken. There are still some in these caves who retain the will to fight. A rune to guide your way lies hidden amongst my old bones. Find the others, together you may prevail. Oh, so I gotta go that way. Now I gotta go this way. So I gotta break them open, save the Unders clan members all over the place. Let's get to it then, however I can. Can I talk to you again? Yeah, you're a little skeleton. Oh, oh here we go. Got that, and that'll open up. Oh my, whoa, that is some movement. Oh my gosh, that guy does look scary. Okay, so what do I wanna do about this? Whoa, whoa, that's so cool! I like that idea, that, just, that one just launches back here. Good to know, though. This one launches me up here, and then I can up, break it. Uh, be a little careful, as much as I can be. Oh. So I wanna try to get all of the pieces of the exit, I suppose. Probably gonna be our best bet. Go to each area and just try to complete it as fully as I can. Oh no, oh, okay. Sort of making some mistakes, but they're also sort of working out for me. Just like that. And then one last one, got it. Okay, so I'm getting tons of stuff right now. Oh, and I got that as well, so this door is now open. You can go that way and we unleashed one of you. Hey, how are you doing? Appreciate the help, Beetle. I'm gonna fight the Screech again. If you're with me, then join me over by the gate. I will, I will. So there's one friend saved. What is with this rock? I guess that way I couldn't have backtracked this way. Does this just loop around up here? Where are we? Ooh, well wherever we are, we got a chest over this way. I don't think this will have a new ability. Most likely it'll just have fruit. Yep, fruit, fruit or like a fruit extender, but you also get a wickerling. Awesome, so that's our sixth one, very good. So before, I guess we could have swam down that way, but it wouldn't have helped us too much. So we're back at the Gorilla Woods. Let me grab these fruit. Just while I'm here. Where does this lead? Oh, a wickerling, up this way as well. Activate that. And then, yeah, I got him. Cool, that's what I'm just trying to do quickly, get that kind of stuff. Cause that's now our seventh. Very good as well. We're in the monkey's armpit, I don't like it. That seems to be everything we can get from around here. Right? Yes, for now. Until we can learn what to do with the little purple flower things, that's a bit of a mystery to me at the moment. So let's go back down and start saving some more of the ninja guys. I don't know what their like type of name is. They haven't really given me that info. I mean, they all have their own name, but I don't know like what their clan name is or something. Okay, the crystal deep again. So we wanna shoot ourselves down here and get started with everything. So we're pounding to find three of them and then we gotta press the button ourselves as well. So we've went to the top right, let's go to the bottom right, which honestly doesn't do too much for me. Huh, okay. Well there was that guy down there, I couldn't quite reach him. That was the guy we saw get crystallized. So I wanna go this way and then we have a couple more options. Ah, that makes sense. Okay, so 
Oh my, I'm a little scared about this. I don't know exactly what we're doing. It looks like I can get some slugs. Yeah, that's what we wanna do. Okay, so grab you. Nice. Got it. Okay, that was a pretty good start right there. And whoa. Whoa. Oh, he didn't work. That was weird. Okay, try to hit it again or not. Ow, ow, ooh. And there's a couple of, oh, pieces down there as well. This one works a little bit differently from what I see. Let's get that slug stuff out again, the slug dudes. And then I wanna go around and then up, oh, I missed. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, well that's one of them. No, 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 oh, come on, come on. I was just trying to, got it. And then, yeah, get that one. So we got one more left to do. And we should be good, right? I think so. I mean, if I go back into the one thing, well, first off, let's get our friend here if I can. Our little bubbled friend. I keep missing him. That's just awkward. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna be able to get him in time. I think he's gonna go away. Come on, don't do it, don't do it. Oh, he went away. Come on. That's just plain silly. Get the slugs again. Go up like that or something. I'm always so bad at aiming. This this should launch me. Yeah, no, oh, yep, this is what I wanted. There we go. Good stuff. So can I grab that one? No, not quite from here. Got that one, and that one, and that one, and then, oh, grab ya, grab that, got that, and then I just gotta get into this one rock. If could find a way to do that, that'd be great. Yeah, just like that, awesome. So we found ourselves an exit. And, oh, wait, no, we're, we're still missing the one piece. I gotta go and get that. I got all the fruit though. That's pretty cool. So d just get, yep, just like that. Okay, this is all going our way now. Ooh. So all we need to do at this point is find out where the heck am I. This guy's gonna explode, which isn't too big of a deal, but except for the fact that it launches me everywhere, when all I wanna do is get to the right side. Got it? No, yep, okay, sort of, not really. Oh no, hold on. The camera thinks I'm up there, that's weird. No, no, I wanna go to the right. I'm just trying to use him to sort of help me get there and it won't stink and work. Come on. Why is it so difficult just to get to the one side of it so I can, no, I can miss again. Get out of here with that. That is total baloney, like maximum baloney. I don't wanna hear it. I can just sit here and indefinitely make him mad or just keep tapping the button. Oh gosh, come on, the slugs are ruining everything. I just wanna to get to the little pinball hole. It's just so difficult to get to from the stinking angle. I don't know why they keep doing that with some of these these like little areas, is that I feel like it's so difficult just to get to where I wanna be, just like that. I don't understand why that's such a challenge, but it is, and I broke ya. Hey, how you doing? Do you have anything to say? Oh, here we go, here we go. Oh. Thank you for saving me. This has gone on for too long. We must fight back. I'll wait for you over at the gate. Join me there if you wish to fight the Screech. I do. Oh, he can launch through these things too, cool. Okay, I haven't seen anybody else do anything pinball-like until then. It is sort of weird that there's just a whole bunch of pinball right of things around here, but not, none of it really has to do with anything but Yoku. That was cool to see. So yeah, we got a couple ways we could go. We could go down to the left before we go down maybe. I can break this. Yep, unlock it. And that just, yeah, another one of these pink flower things I can't quite access. Oh, can I break these bones? Oh, I'm gonna have to use this little kazoo a little bit more. Okay, so we're going down this way. I did see that treasure chest. This will launch me back this way. Okay, so yeah, not working the way I thought it would. Did somebody stop this thing? I don't know how we would get over them normally, but we'll try to find out later. Whoa. Okay, so this seems a bit odd to me. Might not be easy to figure out, but I'll do what I can. There we go, ooh, that was a good shot right there. Total luck as well. Um, There we go. And then, oh, no, get back up there, or not. Try that again. No, <laughs> come on, come on, that was just silly. Also, why were we like all rainbow-like for a second? That was weird. Was I, was I just seeing things there, maybe? That was odd. Okay, we're bouncing, I understand. Gotta move this way. That can just set me back to here. Yeah, I got it, okay, that's all I wanted. Okay, I feel like sometimes like I totally get it and it's working perfectly and other times I'm just like, what the heck is going on? 
There we go, get up here. And boom, the last guy broke it open. I was caught off guard, it won't happen again. I'll wait at the gate. Together we will enter the lair of evil. Okay, we're doing it. We're gonna beat up this dude. So that is all of the guys now unlocked, so we can go this way. Try to see if we can't, yeah, we can't do anything there. Unfortunately, the skeleton guy's gone. Uh, completed, open the gate to the Screech's lair. Wow, this is fancy. So where is that Screech at? The time to face the Screech has come, let's go. Yeah, let's do it. You guys have swords, you look very prepared. I just have a little ball. Got another Wickerling thing. Okay, I only have seven of them for now, but I'll keep you up to date. Uh, oh, yeah, break those guys for sure. Oh, speaking of which, here's another Wickerling. This will be our 10th one. Ah, no, come on, I wanted it. Not our 10th one, our eighth one. I was thinking of 10. That's so stinky. What is over this way? It looks like there might be a little bit of like a secret. Yep, there is. Ah, this is how we get to the treasure chest. Sometimes I just get real sneaky with those invisible walls. I don't know how I feel about that, because there's gonna be a time in this game where I'm looking for like the last thing and it's behind an invisible wall or something. Oh, another uh, bauble. You got the tr the tracker crystal, no, 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 this is not a bauble, it's a tracker crystal deep. Now you can see all the crystal deep wickerlings on the map. Yeah, okay, that's pretty great. So, is there anything this way? I am doubtful. Yep, I was correct to be doubtful. So there we go, there's another treasure chest down and with it, another tracker. So, we can see where all the wickerlings are. Some of which we just simply can't reach for right now. But it seems like the trackers will be very helpful for late game stuff when we do have all the abilities to get to anywhere we need to. We can then just use the tracker to find where the wickerling is, hunt it down, and we'll be good. So that sounds like a lot of fun to me. I'm excited. And uh, now we're just gonna go to the left. See what we end up getting. Oh, it's spooky down here, there's cobwebs. I don't like it. Uh, okay, what is down this way? Whole bunch of nothing. Oh, big old bunch of nothing. Why is it even over here like this? I guess if we fall into the water from the left, we just gotta, it just make no sense. Anyways, what? Oh, okay. Okay, Uh, come on, you can do it. Push, push, push. Yeah. Oh, okay, those bounce you back. Gotta be careful about that. Bounce? But that bounces me the correct way. Okay. Yeah, these little mushroom things are very hard to see, so it's just sort of, you have to, you have to put faith into it. Whoa. Whoa, the crystal deep, the secret, there's no, it's the Screech! Oh gosh, this is creepy. I don't like it, I don't like the Screech one bit. Um, oh, they're the, the guys. Uh, hey Yoku, get rid of the crystal uh, and, and we'll use our swords to make sure work of the, be of, the of that beast. Okay, I will, I'll try to do what I can. Um, the crystal's here? Okay. Unless that, those were what the Screech made. I am so confused. Just hold on tight guys, I gotta figure this puzzle out. Oh, break that crystal, that was pretty good. Ooh, there's another one. So another one takes his place. So this is like a full on boss fight. I like it. Oh gosh, ooh, got some fruit. I mean, I just don't know what stuff will actually help me and what stuff will just get me fruit, is the thing. I mean, obviously I'm not doing too much damage to him right now. I'm just trying to create as many crystals as possible. Or break as many crystals as possible. What I don't like is that rock over above the head of those guys seem to be getting, be getting closer to them. I hope it doesn't like squish them or something. Okay, come on. Get that, oh boy. Whoa, okay. That sort of worked out pretty well. No, not happening, not happening. Oh, can I get it, can I get it? Uh, no. Let's launch ourselves up, get rid of that one. Oh, and he keeps making more of them. See, that rock is about to fall on the slugs and the guys over there, what's gonna happen? I don't like it, I hope they don't get hurt. I mean, I'm doing this whole thing to protect them, to save them. If they get hurt now, it's gonna be silly. Oh, I missed both of them. I went perfectly in between the both of them. Now there's just more of them. Come on. I can't get either of them. Oh, no! Oh, oh, okay. I guess they're coming in. Oh, can I, I can play with them. Oh, cool. What do I, what do I wanna do with them? I don't know. This is a little confusing. I guess I gotta get them into their little sword spot? I'll try my best, that's for sure. It's a little confusing. So if I launch you like that, okay, so yeah, yeah, I gotta get them into the little sword spot. Wouldn't have really guessed that. So I'm gonna focus on you. If I could just knock you through the crystals, you'll go you'll go back down and then uh, launch you, and then I just gotta wait for the perfect time, which is right now. Gotcha, okay, awesome. So now we just gotta hurt him, right? Oh, oh my, whoa, -ho -ho. okay, he ain't happy, boom. Oh, do that again. Do that again, and I can do that with all of them too. So like, I don't really know how much Yoku's actually doing in this situation, but I'll do what I can with them. 
Come on, come on. This makes an un unpleasant noise. I sort of feel bad for the guy. I mean, I probably shouldn't. He's an evil monster, clearly. It's just, oh my gosh, I don't like these noises. Come on. Oh boy. Got it, got it. Okay. Oh, no. There we go. Ooh, that must have hurt. Oh, that's an eyeball, too. Which makes it especially creepy. Oh boy. Oh, they're all locked up again. But not Yoku, for whatever reason. I missed all of them. Okay, not that time, all three of them now. That was cool. So we need to do that again. Looks like it. What's the best way to do that? I'm gonna guess trying to wait for this one guy so that we can launch him around the long way. Something like that. Uh, that worked for that one. Okay, cool. So, launch our friends over and around wherever we can. So that guy's gonna go over there, which is very good. So lastly, we have this one last guy. All I'm gonna do is launch him. And then I just gotta time this right, just like last time. This time I did it a lot easier. Awesome! So they're gonna just sort of wait for the opportunity. Yeah, I gotta land in that. Sort of weird. And all of that combined makes everything happen the way it's supposed to. Got him, got him. Come on. It is interesting though. We get to control more than one character. It's awesome. I really like this game, by the way. It's just, man, an adventure pinball game is such a fun concept. Like, I wish there were more games like this. I mean, it's not the first of its kind. I, I know there's like been like Mario pinball and like Pokemon pinball, but I feel like they were different, you know? This is like an exploring an environment as like a pinball. And those are sort of like still like pinball specific boards. So I think this is definitely enjoyably different in a lot of different ways. Cause it's just a, a Metroidvania. Apparently they've been calling it a pinballvania, which I like a lot, I think that's fun. Okay, so I'm gonna just try to focus on one ninja at a time. This guy honestly doesn't put up too much of a fight. Uh, okay, maybe I should get another guy out here because I'm not doing a very good job at doing anything, really. Come on, ready? Boom, no, not what I wanted. Uh, how do I need him to go? Jeez, this is like, why is it so hard for me this time but so easy last time? Boom, up like that, and then we're gonna focus on this guy on the left so I can do that. So we need to try to get this dude right here when he's done having his good old bouncing time. Oh, they can bounce into each other. I just need him to land on the left, which means he's gonna land on the right. Come on, come on, come on. Buddy, what are you doing? No, come on, I just need you to not do that. But here you are doing that constantly. And then he gets stuck. I don't like how they can get stuck like that. We're just bouncing back and forth because it just eats up a ton of time while I'm just sitting here waiting for them. Wait, we hit max fruit. There we go, see that's almost, no wait, that was the wrong one. No, oh, there we go. Okay, I figured it out. So we just gotta land Yoku right there, and we can hit him for I think the final set of his health. Let's go for it. Got him. Uh, Got him, right? No, get him with any of that. Uh, Okay, not bad, not bad. Oh boy. Come on, come on. Nice. Okay, a little bit more, a little bit more. Come on, we can get him! Come on, beat him up! <laughs> Keep launching those pinballs out of him. Yeah, we beat the Screech! He really does Screech a lot. He's made out of mostly orange juice as well. No, what happened to our friends? I don't know. I'm gonna launch myself up here though. Yeah, we did it, hey guys! You have saved my clanmates and defeated the beast that threatened the God Egg. As thanks, I will honor my part of the bargain. I shall head to the village immediately and lend my assistance to Makuma. If you wish to join me, this shortcut leads to the Gorilla Woods. From there, the beeline should be able to get you to the village in no time. Complete and defeat the Screech! And we got our friend here as well. That's pretty disgusting. Or that got pretty disgusting. Good thing the unders pitched in, but we never managed to break through the Screech's rocky hide. Uh, now we got, we just need to find the last chief, and then Nim can go ahead with the ceremony of healing. Let's go! All right, well we can only hope that that kind of stuff turns out okay. For now, fill up that mailbox, and so this is a shortcut back up that way. A little curious though, if we go this way, and we, yeah, let ourselves down here. Ooh, I found myself a secret, cause now I can get a wickerling. There we go, is that eight? Yep, that is eight. And then this way is just sort of the, the boss fight area again. Okay, there's not really too much more I can do around here. We thoroughly explored it, we had a good time. Okay, I'm so happy with our progress in today's episode. So now we can normally make our way back up here. Gorilla Woods. And what do we got going on now? And I guess I can, whoa, I'm traveling up here. 
That's cool. Okay, so, yeah, I gotta get back to them, see how things are going. I mean, I still need to find out, apparently there's, hmm. Oh yeah, I can swim now, that's right, okay. See, I can activate the beeline now because of that. Totally forgot. Glad I'll be able to do that now. So, we can launch ourselves up like this, go over here, and then swim, swim, swim. Go ahead and activate this little thing as well, because why not? I don't know if this is like a point of completion is to activate all of these, so I'm tempted to do it. Don't fall, Mr. Fruit. Okay, I'll have to leave that one. I mean, we have a lot of fruit right now, 337. So we can go ahead and put a hunter into here and get ourselves another beeline and do a happy little Yoku dance because of it. Yeah, okay, so, oh, we can launch ourselves this way. How convenient, we can just go to a ton of places. And there's a Wickerling right here too. Okay, so go ahead and get you, just like that. The only problem is there's no real way to launch ourselves back up to that one, but it's fine, because we can just go back up this way, right? Actually, a lot of these beelines don't seem like we can get up to them super easily. Weird, okay. Let me go back this way then, because I want to explore it with the beeline as much as possible. It looks like I was going the correct way. This is the end of the beeline this way. I thought that it was gonna bring me to the right and upwards like that, but I guess not. Okay, swim under. Go back over, just like that. So I just wanna keep moving now. I've gotten that wickerling. What about this one? Doesn't look like there's much here. It is weird that they don't have little pads so you can boost back up into them around here all that much. Sort of a shame. Whoa, whoa, what is this place? Check this out a little bit. Got the save. 80, we can afford that. Check this out, whoa! Look at this little island. Oh, this is so cool. I mean, I don't quite need to be over here, but I'm, I wanna have fun. We've done our main objective for today's episode. That was like my main focus. But I'm not getting any farther, am I? How could I? I mean, what is down this way? Oh, doom, but maybe not. Can activate this. That didn't seem to do much, right? Or I just need to activate all of them. What about down here? Don't know what those little things are. Uh. Can I activate this? There we go. Whee! <laughs> okay, that's bizarre. What are these little bugs? I don't know. I don't think I can really do too much more then. I'm like exploring areas that probably, like that's sort of the thing about Metroidvania is you don't wanna explore the areas you don't need to because it'll probably quickly run into something that isn't gonna be worth your time. Maybe if I could just do this and then just fall tactfully. No, not gonna work. Okay, well I did what I could. Don't know how to get that last one. We'll worry about it later. Whoop, and whoop, and whoop, whoop. And let's try to get out of here maybe, if it'll let me. Whee, it will. Cool. So we'll worry about this whole set of islands over here. In a little bit. So there's definitely some interesting stuff going on. Just most of it I can't access. Oh, shouldn't have done that, should I have? Yeah, that's gonna launch me back. Get myself back over there. <laughs> I'm having so much fun now. But what about this one? This has me curious as well. I mean, it does get me to at least one wickerling this way, right? I'd hope. Couple things, actually. Maybe I can just, whoa, be launched in uh, not the direction I was expecting. First off, fill up your mailbox. Yep, yep, yep. Inventor at work, do not disturb. But you might have a delivery. Oh. Can't you read the sign? I don't want to be disturbed, go away! Oh, well, that's great. So I can't go over there, so I might not be able to get that wickerling. It'll have to wait and see. Because if I plop down just like this, and then I bounce off of this thing, oh, I can't bounce off of it. Okay, that's fine. Like I said, we can just fall like this. And I thought there was a wickerling here. There is? Apparently not. Weird, I don't know what I gotta do for this one. Probably something I just can't do right now. Okay, enough exploring areas I just, I'm, I'm sort of helpless in. Let's go to areas I'm not helpless in. Hopefully. Nothing here, right? I wanna check under every time just because it's helpful. Yeah, these areas all sort of plot me in areas I've been to before. So not worth worrying about too much. Whoa, hoo, hoo. where am I going now? I don't know, I'm getting a little dizzy, whoa. That was cool, I like that. So we've been here before. This is where I wanna plop off. I've been looking for this one for a while now. So go ahead and get that guy, and that'll be how many now? 10, nice, so if we run into another totem, which there should be one right here, that is perfect timing. So let's go ahead and get this one. 10 of them, 
So we've already seen this little seed thing, this egg, and we got our third one done. So we've gotten 30 wickerlings in total so far. That's great. Awesome. So what are all of you guys gonna say? Uh, well, I guess we could start with you. Hi, do you have anything new? No, oh, hold on. You should get on with finding those other chiefs at the old one, yeah, okay. So, where is Sal? He said he'd be here. Uh, good to see you, Yoku. I, have seen, I haven't seen Sal in many, many years. It must have been hard to find the secret location of the Unders. I'm not surprised Boone hasn't come down. The space monks are a special kind of weird. The climb up the Ivory Peaks will be hard, but it will be even harder to convince Boone to put their project on hold to help Makuma. Huh, okay. What is this little horn down here? I guess maybe that's the customization thing. Oh, here he is, hey buddy. I wanted to talk to you, see how you're doing. This is really bad, judging from Maku by Makuma's injuries. It is very clear to me. This is indeed the work of the God Slayer. The brand, the, the brand proves it. It has drained a large portion of Makuma's essence. Stand back, Yoku. I shall invoke the ancient powers of the Unders and try to remove the brand. Oh my. Is Whoa, look at you. You're so powerful. Uh, didn't seem to do much. It is no use. The darkness at work here are too potent. You must gather the other chieftains. With them present, we might be able to see Makuma. Okay, there's another beeline that way. I mean, I guess I did stop this a little earlier from the looks of it. Okay, gotta keep that in mind. And then what do we got up here? Oh yeah, this is the uh, searching for answers at the Great Fall, so I still don't have the, the key for that one. But if we head down this way, I mean, I might be able to get a package for somebody. I currently do have a package, I thought. No, wait, can I zoom out a little bit? Yeah, I have one, oh, yeah, for up here. Still haven't reached that area, still don't know how, so I'll probably take a different package. The third and final package I haven't taken, which I think is a purple one. We'll find out. This is Sin. Where's Sin at? Oh, have we been over there? I see where it is, it's on the left. Uh, not quite. Oh yeah, he had a package, ah! I was just there. <laughs> That's not convenient. But then it was telling me to go in here. I guess maybe there's some new customizations. Let's talk to you, let's find out. Hey buddy, how you doing? Uh, let's see if we can do something about that ball, shall we? Hmm, a creep bauble, not bad, not bad at all. A black icker bauble, hmm, well, we can make this work, trust me. The ivory look you've got now, while classic, is much too basic. Don't forget to bring me any sprinkle baubles you may come across. So I can go up to these, and I can change the, the color of the ball. That's so cool. That one's creepy though, I don't like it. Uh, that's why it's called a creepy. Can I turn it back to normal at all? Well now it still has spiders on it. Yeah, I'm gonna clear this off if you can, can you? Uh, web cannonball, beautiful for sure, but it's stickiness is too inconvenient. Don't forget to bring me any sprinkles. Yeah, but how do I, oh, I gotta go into the water, don't I? Yep. Interesting, so those are just like different, I guess, cosmetics we can get. We got a wickerling for it though, that's pretty cool. Let's head back up this way. And, oh, I need to knock this over, since I haven't. And then I should, yep, have plenty to get through this, where we have you, hello, who are you? You have a mushroom on your head that also has a face that you talk through. We fungoids get treated like second class citizens around here. Would you consider yourself above such unwarranted prejudice? Yes. Ah, quiet, you. Excellent. So, let's see you prove it by helping us out. So I guess these are two different people. We've been looking to get our spores to the perfect spot. We think the cliffs up above Makuma would be would do nicely. Here, take these spores. We'll give you a reward once you've infected. I, we mean planted them from above. Okay, so they're sort of like an infectious type of plant. Uh, these spores want to grow above Makuma's pit. Okay, uh, this toolbox belongs to Sandro, the island's fixer. Okay, lots of stuff taken in there. Then we can launch ourselves up here. Whoa, whoa, there's a lot of stuff going on around here. First off, is this where they wanna be put in? Yes, whoa, hey, this spot is great. From up here, we can see everything that's going on in the village. But it's not what we were looking for. We need more moisture, you see. Please, plant our spores in the woods below, somewhere damp where we can gaze upon the impressive statues. Okay, it doesn't look very happy. Uh, so I can't quite do this. Once again, there's a little pink things. All right, well, it looks like there's only one thing I can really do. 
And that's continued going to the right. Yep. Okay, so I think our best bet is to focus on the next guy. I just don't know how to get up to him. He's way up there. And I'm thinking like, maybe we should actually go back to that area again. That might be our best bet. Go back over there again, but go up the way that had the pinball launchers. That might be nice. Okie doke. And we also have the package for the guy, but I think the packages have to wait. They don't seem like they can be very easily solved at the moment. Launch, go this way. Launch ourselves again. Not talking to you at the moment. Okay, see this is what I wanted. Got it, Wee! whoa, hey, okay. Oh, that just got me a wickerling. Wickerlings are nice and not complaining, it's just a matter of, I thought that was gonna head me towards a better direction for where I wanted to go. See, I just don't know, because there's no way to go up from here. How in the world are we getting there? I don't really have any leads at the moment. Maybe I should just try to deliver all the overdue packages. Maybe it'll help me find something that'll lead us up this way or something. Might be a long shot, but it looks like our only shot right now. So go this way if I can. No, I can't build up enough momentum. Sorry, little guy. We're gonna have to plop all the way back down again. Oh, all the way back down. But we're gonna go back through the launcher and see if that can't get me anywhere useful for now. I suppose. Because I still, like, until we can figure out what to do with those pink flower things, we're sort of in this like weird situation. So go up here and start launching ourselves as much and as fast as we can. Got it. Keep going, not quite done. This part's cool though. Whoa. So close to a treasure chest there, but once again, there's a the little pink thing. I mean, we've not really been over there, but I know we can't do much. Okay, so. This is about, no, 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 I gotta go. No, 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 this is great, this is great. Cause I can launch myself up like that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And then boing, boing, great. Hey buddy, I'm back. Uh, Can't you read the sign? No, come on, let me in, let me in, let me in. Oh, what am I gonna do about your package? Nobody wants to talk to me. I can't do anything about it. Well, isn't this? The island's fixer, Sandaro. Okay. I'm just trying to remember, like, what I, what can I do beyond all of that? It's sort of hard to say. Hmm. I'm just trying to think about it, like, I, I really don't know. There has to be something better I can do. I just don't know what that is. I don't know. Like, looking this way. I mean, maybe to go up, I need to go down. There might be something else we can find underwater. I mean, that's how we've found how to, you know, go underwater in the first place is to go downwards. Just taking a look at everything else. Is there really anything else I might be able to do? Hmm. I really don't see much as the problem. Like maybe over that way, but even that looks a little inconspicuous. I'm trying to see. Maybe we should go all the way back to the beginning. Because remember, we can go under the water there now, and that might be good. Okay, that's gonna launch me over this way, not what I want. So plop down like this, We oh boy. Whoa, oh, that was a, oh, wait, what is this? Hold on. Hey, hey, that remind completed, I got it. Are you happy now, buddy? I'm gonna bother you. I didn't realize that was a launcher. I thought that was a, one of the ones that bounces you. Oh, I'm such a dingus. Okay, well, at least I delivered our first package there. Ain't that great. Then I can go this way. That's gonna launch me there. No, 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 not what I wanted. I wanted to move this way. I like I can't make that jump, but that's okay. Just for now, oh boy. Oh, and once again, there's a bouncer there. Some things are really well hidden. It's hard to say. <laughs> okay, so I can actually figure this out. Good thing I took a second visit around here. Seemed to be worth my while. Because we can jump, bounce, and do that. What in the world are these little rocks anyways? Oh, they float! Huh, weird. So we gotta figure more out about that. Like I should, if I launch myself up like this maybe? No, but what did that even do? Hard to say. Let me go back this way. I mean, oh, okay, they're all up here now. Oh, I can go across, can I? Ooh, I like it. That makes sense. So there's a little save spot over here. Can I talk to this head? Or is it just a head? Just a head. 
bounce off of it, maybe? That was oddly pointless. What is with this guy? There might be maybe something with him later, I guess? He's just chilling out. But I wanted to yep, plop over this way and get ourselves a wickerling, and I don't know where this bumper is gonna bring us, but I honestly just wanna plop off the edge. If I can, I might have to go all the way around again. Or I could just do this, uh, no, that's not gonna work. So yeah, no, 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 no. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Because it's definitely possible to bounce over there, which is what I want, I wanna just fall down. I mean, I guess we could sort of cheat that out. I mean, there's no way you're getting over here without knowing how to swim already, so never mind. It doesn't really cheat anything out. But if we run over like this, I should be able to just go, 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 launch myself, get this wickerling, keep moving, and fall, wee, and land right here. This is actually past the island, which is very cool. So I want to check out a lot of stuff around this area. This is sort of creepy. It's just a floating island. But I definitely wanna poke around on the bottom of the ocean. But I think that's where we're gonna be th begin things next episode. For now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Yoku's Island Express. If you want to put a video, make sure you comment Zebra Screecher so I know you've watched it at the end of the URA Zebra Tazic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.